En este vídeo vamos a ver cómo desarrollar la Princeton Offense. Es un, un excelente ataque para enseñar a nuestros jugadores cómo moverse, cómo leer el juego. Aquí os dejamos un clinic de Fran Aloco, un entrenador que ha sido campeón del estado de California. Después de coger un, un equipo con solamente una victoria, consiguió hacerlo campeón y ha sido campeón 18 veces en high school en, en el estado de California. Es un clinic donde hay los drills, los ejercicios para desarrollar este movimiento y para aprender y enseñar a los jugadores a moverse dentro del ataque sin pararse y sin ir como robots. Just go under the hoop here. 
you know, to run this offense, you know, Pete Carrillo, who invented the offense, his thing was, you're never stuck. There's always an option that you can do with this, right? And, and the hook shot is such an important part of this because his theory was, anytime you're stuck in here, and I got a seven foot kid on me, I can always come and shoot a hook shot. So we would teach all of our players would have to be able to hook with either hand. So just start on the block right here and execute like a left-handed hook shot, right? Good, and go to the right side, keep going back and forth. So we go right-handed hook and a left-handed hook, right? So still we want to develop with our guys is the hook shot. Um, we're doing it left-handed and right-handed all the time, okay? Another skill we want to do is all your players have to be able to post up. So start over there and just back cut through, and I want you to seal the lane. And then we'll get you the ball, and you have to be able to score in your post. And what we teach on that cut is, let's say you're guarding me. When I back cut this, I'm going to cut past you. You're guarding me here. I'm coming down to try to beat you at the spot. If I get to here, now I'm going to step here and seal you really deep. Right? So you want your players all to be able to post up and seal in the paint. There's no bigs, there's no littles. Everybody's just a skilled basketball player. Third thing, they have to be able to shoot. You know, and that's something that I don't think we do enough of. I mean, we shot, kids in my program shot a thousand shots a day. We got the gym open at six in the morning. Our kids are expected that they're going to come in before school or after school to shoot thousand shots every day. And they got to the point where they could really shoot it, right? And then the other skill we really want to coach out of this is you have to be able to rip and go. So if we set a screen here and we catch the ball, we really emphasize clipping, getting the ball to this hip, clipping his hip, and getting to the rim. You see that footwork right here? Just catch the ball. I want you to set a screen in that direction. Good, stop. Stop, set a screen. Open this leg up. Now, rip it to the other side. You get past the guy. Good. Good. All right, so we would do developmental drills to do all of those different things, okay? Now, to show the offense, we have four players come out here real quick. So if you dribble at him, your first option would be to back cut, but if you're not, if the guy's not, it's not there, come and get a dribble handoff, and you guys circle on that side. So do the same thing, just exchange. Okay, dribble back up to the top, get to that spot, the main line throw it to him, and you would go circle again, you dribble it up, you can back cut and get a hand off. Good. Just keep that moving. But I want you guys to really try to get up high, you know, to the foul lane extend. Really keep your space. You got it. Four. Circles. The circle lane. Good. 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 That's it. Uh, now, the next thing we do out of that is we'll run squares. So on a square, you're going to throw the ball to him. On the throw, we're both coming down the lane. Look for me for a good and go here. You can dribble it back up to the top. Okay. You come back right back up and go. Go ahead and hit it again. Cut through. Good. Cut through. Good. Popping up. Good. Play the spots. Play the spots. Good. Good. Pull it up. Keep going. Good. Now circle it to the circle to the square. Circle it to the square. Circle it to the square. Keep going. I want to have a circle. Let's get a circle. Have a circle to hang on. So throw it here. Circle it to it. Go ahead. You, now you go there. You're still playing on that side. Keep playing on that side. Good. Throw it. There's a square. Good. Dribble it up. Pass it. Circle on that side. Dribble it up. Hang on. Dribble it up. Hang on. Circle it to the square. Cut. Good. Cut it. Cut it. Good. Good. Okay, hold on. Alright, we'll do one more option. Now this is a, like a football approach to coaching, right? So like, I used to use different formations. So in football, um, you know, American football, they will go on a formation, but the plays were basically the same, but the look they give you is different. Right? And I was a quarterback in college. In fact, if any of you ever heard of Joe Montana, uh, Joe Montana was my backup quarterback. That's a true story. And I blew my shoulder out, and that's how Joe got to play. Uh, he'll acknowledge that too, if you ask him that. 
Um, and by the way, thank God, thank God I got hurt because uh, Joe changed the face of football, right? He's one of the greatest players ever to play. I wasn't very good, but I did learn a lot in coaching and that our football coach, Aaron Persegan, was a great football coach. And he taught this concept of misdirection, which I love in basketball. So we're going to run these three formations into something. Circle, square, and one more. We'll call it X. So you throw it in. Now, you're Xing off the post. Go ahead. And you follow right off the post. You drift back up to your spot. Throw it here. X again. X again. Cut. X, X. You got that way. X. There you go. Keep drilling up. Drill it up. Good. X again. Cut. X. Good. Good. Yeah. Yeah. I want you to run circles and the squares to an X. Okay, go ahead. Do it hard. Let's go. Hard. Circle. Good. Here's the square. Cut. Good. And back up. X. X. Good. 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 Let me have you step in on the post. And let me have four whites come up and guard them. Four whites. We're not going to guard the post. This is a good drill to get you started and running. And by the way, you can run that as an offense. You really can. Uh, it's a good movement. It keeps everybody going. What we're going to do here now is you guys are going to play, but you can always throw the post at any time. Okay, so if we threw it to the post, right? We are going to back, cut through, cut through. If you're looking for us. It's not there. Hit one of them. Go right back up. Run a circle at me. Circle. There we go. I'm looking for this guy. Back up. Cut, cut. You can build a plane. Cut. He fills. It's not there. I'm going to go back door here. Take him all the way through. Keep going. Go up. Go up. Throw it to the post. Throw it to the post. Cut through. Boom. We pop up. Here comes an X. Here comes an X. Good. Stay in line. Go on that spot. Okay? Let's see you guys do that. Go ahead. Remember, you throw the post whenever you want. Whatever you do, you're going to get to us. Stay up here. So you're really, the whole idea is to bring the defense up so you have room to play. Go. Good. Go on. Go on. Go on. Good. 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 Good, throw up, good. Circle, good. Nice. Good. Remember the team went. Here's a good rule. Read the person in front of you and it tells you what to do. You just gotta watch the guy in front of you. Right? So if I see him going circle, I know I'm circle. Watch the guy in front of you, right? If I see him throw in there, he cuts, X, he X, and you gotta know how to X. Follow the guy in front of you. Okay, let's go. Let's go hard. Go, go, go. Good, try to get X. Oh, you got X, 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 good. Good, cut. There you go, good, good. And one more time, that's pretty good. And these guys can run this for 10 minutes, right? And then land. So I'm not going to drill this. Let's go hard. Hard, hard, hard. Go ahead. Sit. Oh, I'm not going to do it. I quit. I'm done. That's all you guys got to know. I'm going to do it again. Perfect. Now go ahead. One more time. Keep going. Great stuff. Great stuff. Y bueno, tanto si os ha gustado, si os gusta o incluso si no, darle al botón de suscribiros y a la campanita y podremos seguir haciendo vídeos como este. Hasta luego.